it's Saturday, you're watching Lesbian Central, I'm Kelly, and I'm really sorry that this video is late, never sign up to be a tour guide at your school. This is, this is still my roommate Margot, and this is my to-be roommate Megan. Um, I look like I should be named Steven. No, you look like somebody. <laughs> oh, mother! <laughs> what was your, uh, experience with your sexual education? Like, at school? Yeah. I, it, there really wasn't one. Really? Yeah. Kind of. I don't know. Maybe I just didn't listen. <laughs> In fifth grade, they separated the guys and the girls, and I was like... I remember that. Told us about our women and women business. Business. To give us and then the I learned way. about sex from The Sims, like, officially. Yeah, she did. <laughs> Eight years old. When I was in the fifth grade, they separated us and told us, like, why we shouldn't be blood brothers. Because AIDS and HIV. <laughs> it's just a lot of hair. <laughs> and then they gave us deodorant. <laughs> and then, yeah. I didn't get free shit. Oh, we got cookies. I got pads and deodorant. I got a we just got saying cookies. I wouldn't be blood brothers with anyone. <laughs> cookies. Cookies! Which one's the more hardcore school? <laughs> the cookies one. Vote here. No. In the link below. No, there's no I've votes. always wanted to say that. It's <laughs> on the link below. In the link below. The link that will be on my face. <laughs> We're having it like once a year. Like a, once every like four years. I got it like once in elementary school, once in middle school, and like once in high school. Um. When I found out about Sex or the Sims, I wasn't even like date, like phased by it at all. I was just like, sweet, now I know how to make babies in it. Oh yeah, when I was raised by crazy hippies, there's a lot of nudists involved in my childhood, and I, I gathered questions, and um... This is why I don't ever put you in my videos. Why? There needs to be joy. You have that one viewer who thinks I'm good looking. I'm keeping that part of Hey. 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 Why do I wear hats more often? Where are my gloves? <laughs> you guys, follow my Tumblr. It's <laughs> the... This has nothing to do with sex. My then. Tumblr is the-sexual-tyrannosaurus. Follow me. The link will be above my face. Mine's no, it's not. Mine's destroyed perfection. There is no link. Just find me. <laughs> I want to work at a Victorian like burlesque club. Be like, I take off one glove, sir. <laughs> Ooh. Want to see my ankle? <laughs> this is why I don't. <laughs> How do you think they could improve sex education in public schools mostly? Because I don't want to talk about private schools. They should consistently have it. Like, not once every other year. Like, every year for, like, a semester or something. I feel like the uh, teachers don't actually teach you this. Put a book in front of you. And no one actually does anything. I actually had a pretty good sex, sex education in high school, um, probably because we had a pregnancy issue and they're like, we should step something up. Um, we but, learned about safe sex though a lot. Yeah. Um, I don't know about any other schools. I think, I, mean, I don't even remember mm -hmm. like taught, saying the word condoms ever. My teacher, she taught us about condoms and like all that stuff. She taught us about dental dams or whatever. But I think that it should be part of the curriculum to teach more tolerance and about different types of sex and it's not just straight sex, and also talk about things like extreme consent, like, and, uh, safe words even, like, whatever you, like, gotta do to explain just how important consent is and how important safe sex is, but in a non-shaming way. This is, I deserve this. So you get a recording with me and Megan. <laughs> you guys wanted to be in it! Hell yeah, I need to be on camera more. <laughs> the camera loves me. Just don't have sex if you don't want it. Education is that there's a lot of slut, sluttle, sluttle, shut, shuttle, shuttle bus. <laughs> a lot of subtle <laughs> slut shaping. Being a slut is just having sex with a lot of people. It doesn't mean it's a bad thing. It's just a name yep. for what you do. Yep. I don't even think you should call it that. You should just be like, that's that lady that has sex as much as she wants with whoever she wants consensually. That even that shouldn't even so be a thought. Well. It's like that, that's that's a happen. nice lady over that's there. That's a nice lady. I mean, you can't assume that she's nice. Well, I mean, if but. she's nice, she's nice. If yeah. she's not, but her having sex has nothing to do with any of that. Yeah. So unless she cuts off people's hands, it's during just sex. a vagina. It's just a vagina. It's not always a vagina or a pee. Oh, it's yeah. just a vagina. We're in between. Please do it. Sex. 
can take longer to I edit. think sex is also emphasized as being something really important when in reality it's not. Yeah, no, sex really isn't that big of a deal. It's <laughs> just so let's 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 summarize. Less shaming, more tolerance, make it happen. Include make it happen. Make just make it happen more. Uh include same sex couples, include transgendered issues. Transgender issues, sorry. Because that's the thing. No matter how hard you try, uh, still I there. <laughs> I'm not surprised! You always do! <laughs> Subscribe, follow me on Tumblr, make out with someone, or don't. I don't care. Do what you like, <laughs> makes you happy. But I know for me, tongue fun is awesome time. But fun. Tongue time. Tongue fun. But fun. Also, butt fun. I hope you guys have a good week. Apologize for how poorly edited this video is. Um, they say real offensive shit, and I just cut it out. I didn't even try to make it I didn't smooth. We didn't say anything offensive about you. Yes, you did. No, we didn't. A couple points. It's just offensive. They talked about jokes. me and my cats. I'm not being serious. Alright, let's edit this. Help, I'm stuck in the box of shame. I hope you guys have a good week. The box of indifference. Goodbye.